Hi guys, time for another paper aeroplane from the complete book of paper aeroplanes by David Woodruff that I only paid £1.25 for in a charity shop, Cancer Research UK. We're working our way through. We're up to page 110 out of 180 something. Oh, 190. Right, so what are we going to do? We're going to use a piece of paper rather than rip the page out. You can rip the page out, follow the fold instructions, but if you do that then you've pinched the instructions from the next page. You could start from the back and work forwards, that way you've always got the instructions for the next one going that way. Or you could photocopy it. Or you can do what I'm going to do which is use a separate piece of paper. If you need to take any measurements off there, I found that if I measure in centimetres, and then on my A4 piece of paper, I use half an inch, that's the equivalent of a centimetre, then the measurements work out nicely. So, where are we going to start? With printed side face up, and when they mean printed side they mean the bit with the pretty picture on it, but I happen to have second hand paper, fold it in half. And then unfold it. Turn it over, doesn't tell you to turn it over there, but turn it over, fold those corners down. And then fold it down. This is where we should have taken a measurement, but I'm just going to judge it. Okay, that was that fold, and fold those in, now hang on, turn it over that way, hang on, I've done that, that's right, that way, right, don't panic, fold it that way, that way. What's this one called? Charger Racing Plane. Did I say that? I don't remember I did. Anyway, this is the Charger Racing Plane. Done that, and then that bit that's sticking out at the bottom there, fold over. Okay, then fold the plane in half. Stiffen them up and then fold it the other way. Ah, now here we need to have a bit of a, a bit of a slope on it. So again, I'm just going to judge that. a bit of a slope it's lower there higher there which is that fold on there and then we've got some bits sticking down on the outside be a good idea if we made them the same on both sides. And 
And there we go. That is our Charger racing plane. So we'll see if it flies. There we go guys, the Charger racing plane. I must say that one went very nicely. In fact, too good for in here, it wants a much longer distance to fly. Because if I throw it hard, it climbs and hits the ceiling. But if I give it a nice gentle launch, then it works absolutely fine. Thanks for watching. You'll find more information down in the video description. You might like to watch that video up there. And you might like to subscribe over there.